Hello everyone, welcome back. Let's make jalebis today. Since tomorrow is dashera, it's the perfect occasion to make these at home and impress your family and friends. Now I know jalebi might seem a bit tricky, but it's actually quite simple. We'll start by soaking a generous pinch of saffron in hot water for about 15 to 20 minutes. For the sugar syrup, heat a pan and add 200 grams of sugar along with 100 ml of water. Add the soaked saffron mixture into the sugar syrup and cook it on low heat until the syrup reaches one string consistency. Do not forget to add a teaspoon of lemon juice. This helps to prevent crystallization of the sugar syrup. Once done, set the sugar syrup aside. Now let's move on to the jalebi batter. Take half a cup of maida in a bowl and add curds. Mix them well. Then add a pinch of salt and a pinch of turmeric powder. Gradually add water and mix until you have a semi-thick batter. Finally add baking soda and give it a good mix. Transfer the batter into a piping bag. Pipe concentric circles directly into medium hot ghee or oil. Fry on low heat until the jalebis are crispy. Next, drop them into warm sugar syrup and let them soak for 3 to 4 minutes. Make sure the jalebis are fully coated in the syrup as this will give them that signature sweetness and a beautiful sheen. But do not let them sit too long as they can become soft. Once they have absorbed the syrup, remove them gently. Repeat the process with the remaining batter. And just like that, your instant jalebis are ready. Garnish them with dried rose petals for a festive touch. If you enjoyed this recipe, do not forget to hit the like button and subscribe to the channel for more delicious recipes. Thank you for watching.